right, today we're going to be taking a tour from 115 <coughs> here at the Fair, uh, Town Place Suites by Marriott. You can see we're in the corner with room 116. So let's go into the room. Keyless doors. And as you walk in the room, the first thing you'll notice, this is an extended stay hotel. <clears throat> so I'll put this here. And we'll start off with security features. You can see here we have a fire map. Very easy to note. We're in the last room here. There's an exit here or an exit here. There's the elevator and the front desk. There is a building A and a building B. We are in building A, the main building. For security features, latch lock or latch lock and deadbolt. Uh, there is a panel here. It says general electric on it, but it doesn't do anything. So when you first walk in, you see the living room and here is the kitchen. We'll go ahead and turn on a light here. Now, the I noticed as I was looking up at this that there is a weird stain on that light. I don't know what it is, but it's there. So looking in the kitchen, we have a Frigidaire mini fridge with, with a few things. Um, open it up. Clean, temp control up there, and some door pockets. Freezer, temp controls back here, and some ice trays. There's no frost at all. General Electric, well, it's Frigidaire, but, you know. Here we have a mini stove with actually four burners, which I think they could have easily gone with two. There's a tiny little oven down here. Open that. And we got some burners, which do work. Rear. I can feel it getting hot. Definitely. And then this down here is... A storage area I guess um up here we have a light and a fan very powerful up above here in these cabinets oh wow they put stuff up here can barely reach it but there are some pots and pans almost looks like a spaghetti strainer and up here is some more pots since you know it's Marriott they want to make you feel at home uh, under here is the sink and a garbage disposal. Uh, in here we have glasses, a measuring cup, plates, cups, a bowl, little little oatmeal bowls. Uh, down here we have trash can and the sink, some paper towel in here. What is this? Some trays. Interesting cabinets. Here we got some silverware. It all looks like it's in very nice shape. I'll give you a ladle in case you're making soup. I guess these are fake. And they even give you a little dishwasher. And there are dishes in there. How nice. This reminds me a lot of my old dishwasher. Nice. Yep. Looks just like my old dishwasher. What brand is this? GE? Yep. GE. Guess you can lock it. Very simple to operate. Options and a knob. Here they have a coffee maker, which there is an outlet, so that does work. Mm, coffee pot's a little bit dirty. That's something that I don't know how that passed, but ugh. That is disgusting. Look at that. There's like all kinds of just grime and stuff in there. Let's see if this is clean. Now I'm probably going to take the whole thing apart, but that's fine. And they even give you a microwave. What's up here? We already looked up there. Let's see if we can look up here. Oh, wow. They even, wow, they even put stuff up here. There's a toaster up there. I guess they expect their guests to be over six feet. Jacob. And they even have a microwave, a GE stainless steel microwave. It's very small, but it looks clean. All right, so now we will move into the bathroom. So the bathroom here, it's very nice. We do have a bunch of stuff in here. Drawers are clean. That is a hair dryer that they provided. Toilet plunger and some tissues. And again, some more placebo drawers. There I am. And behind the door, let's look. Wow, they did clean back here. I've had a problem with that in past hotels. And in the bathroom here, there's a fan. 
Uh, I'll go ahead and swing the door shut behind me. It's clean in here. Got clean towels. These are nice. These are weird feeling towels. Picture. And the toilet. It's a colder toilet. Let's go and flush it. Nice. Here we have the shower. Of course, we have the arch shower curtain. It looks like it has a little bit of a uh, rust on it. Shower looks in good shape. That's my bar of soap, by the way. <laughs> there is no issues with the ceiling except for a few little spots there. Very nice, like, the walls in the shower are just so finely crafted. Just the care. Floor is a little bit dirty, but... It's probably because this is from, I'd say, around the 80s. They do have a grab handle here, hence this is not an ADA compliant room. They do have good pressure. Oh, it's cold. Wow. Okay. Good pressure there. Close this. Shower curtain is clean leave here and we'll look at the living room so here they have a table which is nice so looking at the living room they do have a tv let's see if that works should yep okay My character Michael's okay we're good <laughs> Uh, they have a little space down here. They do give you a magazine. That's nice. Remotes all in good shape. Oh, this is really wrinkled. I don't... What is this? I don't know. I don't know if that's supposed to be there or not. Yeah, it is. It says HBO Guide. Uh, back here we have a lamp, which I don't know how you can turn on. Maybe. Yep, there we go. They do have a nice chair here. It is not dirty at all. And the pillow is in good shape. They do give you these like armrest things. I guess you could set a drink on it. Technically, they do have a little table here. Windows out to the parking lot. Let's try and fix this kind of poor design there. And they have a little table here. Here is a little thing. I'll go ahead and sit on the couch to show you. So it's like guest services, more guest services, lots of guest services. <laughs> What's back here? Places to go, safety. Here's a property layout. So this is building A. This is where we are. See, that's office. And then right here is us. Parking, 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 parking. This is building B. And the pool's right there. Telephone, I guess. And that's it. So Oh, that's in good shape. And another lamp. Interesting thing back there. Got an old phone jack. I guess this is here. Not sure what that is on the table there, but I guess it's put drinks on. Okay, nice couch. It's very smooth. No issues with it. Interesting little armrest here. It's like a leather thing, but it's attached. I don't know what that is. Is that a rib? No, it's a zipper. Pillows in good shape. Now we're going to take a look at the bedroom. So the first one we'll look at is my parents' room. This is where we're staying. So it's a very large room. Now there's actually no ceiling light in here. So we'll go ahead and turn that this slide on. And here we have a dresser with very loud drawers. <laughs> so let's look over here first. This is a nightstand, I guess, and little light. That clock is telling the correct time? Yes, it is. Drawers, they give you the Bible and the book of Norman. Let's look in the closet. Oh, it's hard to open. Just a basic closet. There's a laundry basket there, and the hangers are really high up. They really expect people like Jacob Bakta to come and stay here. <laughs> I know I'm talking about him a lot. Get to the bed in a minute. Panasonic TV. It looks like the same one that's out there. Uh, 
Yeah, I think it's the same one that's out there. Mm -hmm. Okay. There. And I'm going to move the TV slightly because it drives me nuts when I see it. People not plugging in their stuff into the wall all the way. Uh, TV remote there. Drawer. Same furniture as out there. Another view. We're on the first floor, so it's... You know, and they have another phone jack. There is a desk in here. It's not out there, but it's in here. Desk chair looks in good shape. Interesting little lamp there <laughs> with the USB port. So, yeah, and there's an outlet there. Very nice bed. I, this is a queen size bed. Ooh, oh, that's not, oh, I don't know what that is. Very nice pillows. Look to be in good shape. Yeah, I don't see any stains on them. That's good. That pillow's really thick. I'm not going to go into super detail on this bed because I'm going to go into detail on the other one. So. Pillows look good. Ugh. Um, do we look in here? Yeah, we did. Let's check under the bed. And it's hollowed out. Yes, I like it when hotels do that. And here's the back. You can see the door's kind of on a weird angle. Now let's go look at the other bedroom. My bedroom. I feel like I'm in New York City here with this apartment or hotel setup. You can see my room is much smaller. Same setup with the light. My TV is up higher. They like Panasonic TVs. I guess I turned it on. Let's see if it works. Okay, it says power. Yep. TV remote here. Big drawers. door here it swings shut nice picture let's check over here this is where we're gonna go into detail clock telling the correct time book of mormons i'll leave that on they have another phone jack this is definitely an older place here's the closet which there's some stuff in there so it's you know got stuff in it here's my view same as the other room Ooh, what is that is that an old water pipe I think it might be cool. Oh, I'm getting hit in the head with these. And there's a floor lamp here. There's a little rat's nest of wires here, but at least it's there. What's down here? Let's check the floor. This bed is also hot. What about good? All right, let's go into detail on the bed. We already looked at the covers. I expect no problems. This is where I'm sleeping, so obviously I'm going to go into detail. I don't care about my parents. I don't want to know what I'm sleeping in. Pillow looks good. It's nice and cool in here, too. Very squishy. Um, oh, what is that? Oh, that's just fuzz. Bottom pillow. Looks good. Let's check the... I'll check it on the other one. The pillowcases on here are kind of hard to get off, but you gotta, like... Hold on. Ah, uh, there we go. Pillow's in good shape, that's good. Obviously a bottom pillow sitting on the bottom. So put that there, they gave me four pillows. This looks like it's in good shape. Oh, hold on. Yeah, I'm getting up on the bed, I admit it. Nope, no stains. Let's check this. Here's the mattress. Very comfy mattress. This is also a queen size bed, I think. Well, no, maybe it's a full. Let's check under the mattress. Yep, that's clean. So, Marriott, good job. I don't want to slam any companies, but I stayed at a Hampton Inn a while back, and I found two stains on the same bed. Not something I expect from Hilton. I don't really care how the pillows are put back, since I will mess them up anyways. I like this kind of like a comforter thing. It's really interesting how it's like wavy. Oh, uh, turn off these lamps when the 
lamp got no my baby cried. Sorry. Oh boy. Same alarm clock. My mom noticed mine has this cool LED thing. I think hers does too. We just couldn't figure out how to turn it on or off. So, I guess that's your tour of our extended stay. I mean, Marriott. I mean, it is an extended stay, but like a lot of times people will refer to extended stay America as just the extended stay. So, yeah, I guess for now, that's it. Five stars. Good job, Marriott.